And uh, so uh, why don't you come here for a second? We're going to warm up doing some Sinawali drills. Um, go ahead and stand at that point right there. Uh, so we're going to work on footwork, uh, geometrically spacing, but we're moving off the X. Um, go ahead and switch spots with me real quick. If you notice, this makes like an asterisk, right? We've got our forward angles, our lateral angles, and uh, straight forward and side to side. Basically, I can move in any direction. What we're going to do is starting at apex. So go ahead and start at the point with your feet together, hands up like this. Go ahead and step to apex at this point right here, but keep your back foot back, so don't travel the back foot. Start with your feet together and then just take a step, right? So we're going to be moving laterally, right? Um, a lot of times when somebody goes to fight, they're going to attack straight down the center line. Don't, don't move right now. Well, a lot of times they're just going to come at you straight down the line. If you step at me to hit me with this hand, you're coming straight down the line, straight down the line. just like I did. Watch me. Stepping forward to hit, it, you know, like this, right? If you step forward to hit me, and I move off the line, it gives me the advantage of sectoring or quartering, flanking kind of thing, right? So as he moves to me, I want to move off the line. So we're going to incorporate that into our drills right now. Basically, we're going to be moving right and left. So step back behind the point, right, and step right. Now give me an angle one, and then you're going to chamber by your head, and angle two. Step back to apex, step left one two we're just doing high high right so high 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 and we're just going to warm up with that get used to moving laterally don't let your hands get ahead of your feet so step then strike so that you have your whole body when you're striking make sure that your feet are planted first get your feet planted and then use your rotation. All right, so partner up. Go ahead and step right here with me. Um, so we're not stepping sideways like this, stepping on a forward triangle. So make sure that you're moving forward. Right, so he's going to step forward with his left. I step forward with my left, but off at an angle. And then one, two, step back, step off. So make sure that you're not stepping this way. I'm stepping this way. Uh, if I, if uh, Go ahead and step up to hit me. Now, right now, don't move. I can't hit him. But if I step this way, I can hit him. Now, sometimes that's used as a divisionary tactic where he steps to hit me, and I move off the line to avoid being hit. But if I want to hit him, I need to make sure that I step into hitting range, right? So as he steps, I'm here, and I'm here. Now, your hand's coming down. Keep that up. So up like a boxer. One, two. One, two. Keep it up like a boxer, right? All right. I need you right there. All right, so now we're going to do, this is high, high. We're going to do high, low. So when uh, we step right, I'm going to go high, chamber at my hip, and low, and then step back high, low, high, low, high, low. High, make sure you chamber at your hip, and then low. All the way through, and low. Uh, go ahead and step forward in a fighting stance, and just hold your stick out, fighting stance, like this. Uh, but now give me an angle one with this one. Now if I hit and retract, that's a broken strike. If I go all the way through, that's a fluid strike, right? So the first strike is fluid, and then go ahead and chamber and give me it on the backhand side. Fluid, right? So I'm going to go one, two, step back, step forward, one, two. Now the target is I'm going for his temple. He's going for my temple. We meet in the middle. And then the target is knee. He's going for my knee, and I'm going for his knee, and we meet in the middle. Right? So we're going to go temple, knee. Temple, knee, temple, knee. All right? 
Partner up and work on that. 